All right, let's do a, a simple version of the stack pass that I like that translates well to gi and no gi. All right, so this is for when we can get our partner's feet up in the air like this. A quick way to enter into this, to practice getting those double under grips without telegraphing it too much, always inside position, inside position, and then we're just gonna drop to both knees right here, just like this. Drop to both knees, and hands. Now I'm gonna pick which side I wanna to pass to, and I'm gonna bring my shoulder right behind the knee. I don't really too much worry about stacking my partner's knee up. I wanna put a little bit of pressure, but that's not my main concern. So right from here, I'll hug the leg, and I'll put the knee right behind my shoulder, right here. Okay, I'm not worried, like I said, about pushing this knee as much as I can forward. I'm mostly worried about walking around the guard and not throwing the leg across. I'm in a really good spot to start to finish this pass. Keep my elbow tucked here so they don't push it. Elbow tucked. Use my feet up on my toes. Walk around for our pass. Okay, there's a, a couple things to watch out for. One of those is not letting your elbow flare out too much. So if I'm here, my elbow flares out, your partner can push this elbow away, which is annoying. So let's keep the elbow tucked. You can even use your other hand if you want to connect. Okay, here, you can even go here, okay? But I prefer just to leave this hand on the mat. Okay, the other thing is don't throw the leg. Okay, so once we drop into our position here, drop right to your knees, here. Pick a side, tuck the elbow on my toes. Right from here, you're gonna be tempted to throw the leg across. But again, we're opening the elbow, okay? That could be a mistake. So I want to move myself all the way around the guard. Tuck the elbow on the toes. I'm going to walk around the guard here. And the legs will fall away. And that is a simple version of the stack pass.